All right, so this is uh, the start of our adventure to Yellowstone. I guess it starts with leaving work for a week. Kind of not used to that. I don't know if I like it, but uh, it'll be all right. Things will get taken care of. And uh, got the Zuki all unloaded so I can leave it at the rental place without losing all my tools, I guess. And uh, yeah, we'll see. Uh, we'll get update. I'll go get the rental car and uh, then get home, collect the babe, go on a road trip. All right, so we're at uh, Enterprise Rental Car, and I'm just dropping off the, well, I'm leaving the Zuki here in their uh, side lot and uh, picking up the Dodge Grand Caravan, which is really nice. All right, so the van's home, and I'm home, and the packing is underway. Like we got a lot of food stuff and and that on the table that's getting ready to go and uh, throw some shoes some shorts and some coats in the in the bag and in the van and we'll go I know it seems an impossible thing but we actually are ready to go look look she's in the car all right we're out of here We'll see you in about 12 hours, Kate. Well, 16, 17 hours, something like that. Bye, you guys. Bye. All right, this is us. We just stopped, uh, just past Kellogg. Stopped for gas. Kate, you'd recognize this gas station. For some reason, it seems like we stop here every time we go through here. I don't know, it's kind of weird. But anyway, we're getting back on the freeway. We'll see you guys in just a bit. All right, so we're stopped in between Missoula and Butte. And uh, it's 6.20, so I'm starting to get hungry. So we made ourselves a, a ham and cheese tortilla. Your mom's having turkey and cheese or chicken and cheese. And uh, as soon as we're done eating, we'll scoot on out of here. So there's nothing but pine trees. All right, from Clinton on the way to Butte. All right, we're here in Bozeman. Um, you see we're at the Bozeman Inn. I don't know if you can read it from this camera. This self camera is more for selfies, I guess. But uh, anyway, we're no worse for wear. A little bit tired, but uh, we're here, so we should be tired. Okay, we're in the Walmart of at Bozeman because your mom just had to get some stuff from Walmart. And check this out. This is the Bozeman. I hear you hold it out the window over there. This is all, on all sides, uh, about maybe 200 feet, 300 feet deep at the bottom of the Walmart parking lot. It's all, all covered with RVs. And seriously, they go on for, I bet there's what? I bet there's 50 in here. morning in Bozeman now and uh, the Bozeman Inn was very comfortable and uh, yeah we're just getting ready to head out let's see, let's see if you can see the Bozeman Inn sign you can't know oh, it's clear down there huh? and uh, yeah I think we just need a cup of tea and a shower I, I'm gonna shower when we get to the cabin and uh, yeah we're almost ready to go we're and turn in our keys and, and head out and and it was kind of neat because the key was actually a key look that's the <laughs> uh, you, you know in a hotel you get used to getting card keys but no nope, actual key back to the 90s all right we'll check in with you once we get going all right so the, the sun in Bozeman as I know you can't see it very well but it's super red because of the smoke and by the way, this is where this is where all the smoke is coming from, is around here. And uh, so the air is starting to clear up a bit, and the smoke isn't so much. Ah, look at this! Oh my gosh! I don't look at so far with this cup of tea. All right, you guys have a nice morning. Here's another interesting thing that uh, we ran into last night. Are there mosquitoes in 
Montana. Oh my gosh. Just this morning, like in this parking lot, it's furious. Want something to kill them all. It's crazy. All right, so this is um, Yellowstone, and we're at the uh, Old Faithful in general store and I'm gonna get another cup of tea. Great. All right, here we are at the general store, Old Faithful General Store, it's called Hamilton's Store. And there's my baby standing in front. Let me zoom in a little bit. Oh, you're okay. Yeah, it's very cool. The way they use the knotty pine and stuff. Let me, let me walk up on her. Yeah. yeah, you look really nice, babe. So Cade came down and met us at the uh, Hamilton's store. Hey. Yeah. And uh, I guess this is the lower general store. It is. And then up there is the Old Faithful Lodge. Inn. And then, oh, the Old Faithful Inn. Where's the lodge then? The lodge is on the other side of it. Okay, and the other, other side. And then the snow lodge is over further that way behind that big building. And then Cade lives somewhere behind this building a ways. Yeah, so we'll get to see all that in a bit. But anyway, we're here. Got to see Cade. <laughs> Mission accomplished, check. We can leave now. <laughs> yeah. All right. So this is Cade showing us around the lodge or the inn. Pretty amazing. Serious scaffolding work. It's a nice clock. On a big, on a big fireplace. And loads of people. This is where Cade works. This is the snow lodge and you can see that archway. Um, that's the main entrance. But we came around the gift store side and this is where Cade works. You can tell the altitude difference when you're talking because you don't get as much out of it. It's kind of weird. I like it. Interesting. Right, this is the inside of the snow lodge where Cade works. So there's Dean. Sorry, just make all the rest of us look bad. No, so. All right, and that's Kathy behind the counter that he introduced us to. It's really nice post and beam. I love it. So this is us at Biscuit Basin with Cade. And uh, you can see the blue waters behind. Super pretty. As you can I, I told you to cut that off. Sorry. <laughs> this loop was really tiny, so Kate's going to take us to a place called Mystic Falls. And uh, this, here, go stand up there, babe. Was this the one that was geysering just a bit ago? That one? No. No? No, that was, that Down was there? the mushroom one you saw earlier. Oh, oh really? Oh, wow. crap. Totally missed that. Oh. Well. All right. So this is uh, on our hike up to Mystic Falls. Mystic Falls, and this scenery is just becoming sort of amazing. All right, carry on. All right, so me and Kate hiked up here. He was feeling a little bit dizzy. I think her English blood can't take the altitude. And uh, that's pretty spectacular. And uh, the shame, she missed out a little bit on this, but not that big of a deal. The scenery is awesome coming up here. Yeah, amazing. There's a rock along our, our walk here. That's just cool as hell. You know, like a razor clam, but a rock. How's that? Cool? 
So, oh, what's the name of this? Mystic Falls. Yeah. Mystic Falls with Cade in Yellowstone. Pretty amazing. You see the mist up at the top. Cool. <laughs> and then, I wonder if we can spot your mom from here. No. Just around the corner, huh? Alright. There's me and Kate up at Mystic Falls. You can see the falls behind us, between us. That's pretty cool. Every turn you want, every turn it's like a different, it's like a different, uh, what do you call it? Landscape? Yeah, a different landscape on every turn on this hike. It's really cool. Really loving it. This is us eating in the old faithful inn cafeteria lodge. lodge cafeteria the inn is the big log thing the inn yes. the lodge is the hotel no lodge is big logs they both they're both wow. so anyway we're in the cafeteria and outside the window you can see big faithful it's about ready to go off and uh, your mom's having Fish. yellow yellowstone trout. trout so is Cade. and i'm having bison meatloaf which is delish and, uh, here, show a happy face. Oh, she's got a carrot in her mouth. That was unappealing, wasn't it? That's okay though, she's still pretty. D. Hmm? <laughs> what's this what's this overlooking, Cade? The Grand Prismatic. Grand Prismatic. Well named. Yeah, we hiked from the bottom up to the top here. Yeah. Drastically different picture today, huh D? Yeah. yeah. Nice hike. It's an amazing, amazing pool. Oh, you're okay. This is us at uh, oh, the book. Book Peddler, book Peddler, where they have Wi-Fi, and uh, we tried to download some of the videos I've taken, but mm, no luck. So we just, I had a croissant, and your mom had another cup of coffee, and Kate already had a. a some Italian soda, so he was he's done. Anyway, we're gonna walk around West Yellowstone today and look at some of the gift shops and stuff. That's today. So we're we're in the, the Yellowstone Museum, and uh, I wanted to come in here because I remember going in as a kid and they had a giant stuffed buffalo, and uh, they don't have the buffalo anymore because I think he probably rotted away. But they have a stuffed grizzly bear. We'll see in a bit. Original tour bus. It's kind of this room kind of explains that you know it wasn't just uh, it wasn't just Yellowstone itself, but getting to Yellowstone in the old days was part of the trip. It was you know everything was wilderness. Yellowstone was unique because of the geysers and all that kind of stuff. But if you were coming from Oregon on this on the uh, what they call it the Yellowstone Special, the trip itself was half the half the trip. Well, it was half the adventure because it was through the wilderness itself. Uh, my worst nightmare ever. <laughs> Here we are at the Fountain Paint Pot, and it's pretty amazing. And Paint Pot is really aptly named. The blues are so fantastically blue, and look at the bubbles down there. Look how it's just oh, it's so hot. You see them, D? They're not even making it to the top. It's so hot. Oh yeah. And uh, and then down there, the oranges and whites are crazy and there's my baby and our baby this actually isn't found paint pot that's up there this oh is just, still this is just a this is just a spring it's awesome though can you mute that out <laughs> <laughs> this is uh, one of the bubbling goos You're okay. Thank you. <laughs> I'm not sure what this one's called, but it's it's pretty amazing. It's an awesome continuous power. And it's got another one down here that keeps going as well. This is the hotel.
hotel in Lake Village. That's where Cade reckons he'd, he'd like to work if he comes back to Yellowstone. Very posh. So this is Lake Lodge. And uh, you see those two folks right there. Dean and Cade. Yeah, it's really nice. Beautiful. Yes, we're here at the Mud Pots. Mud Volcano. Mud Volcanoes. Mud Volcano. And uh, What do you think, baby? I love it. Isn't it cool? Oh. <laughs> <laughs> this is a really neat feature. It has the sound sounds like a breathe, you know, breathing dragon in there in the steam. So this is the swamp in Lord of the Rings, as Gade pointed out. <laughs> you can see the little path they followed and wonder what they did with all the dead bodies, Gade. <laughs> Just got rid of them, huh? Anyway, if there was smell-o-vision, you'd be smelling it. Go back there, Cade, where you were. This is a rim trail along Canyon. And, uh, it's pretty spectacular. Yeah, that's pretty amazing, isn't it, Kate? It is. Can't quite see the water, but almost. This is us on the rim. A little off trail, but a little off trail. And you actually see the river down there on this one. And that is pretty amazing. This is Cade and Dee off trail. Looking at the waterfall. I love that green. That's pretty amazing, huh? Scooch over, babe. Just have a seat on that rock there, sweetie. That's super cool. Here we are. The canyon over the edge. What's that kid? There, those people over there. Inside. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. That's artist point. Oh okay. How do you get over there? It's on the other side. Totally. <laughs> that's that's that door. You pass it over there. The road goes around there. Oh okay. I'm with you. The other loop. Yeah. Whoa! It's terrifying. Uh -huh. I might survive it. This is Gibbon Falls on the Gibbon River.
dragon tongue print spreads me out so much. What are you talking about? Oh, that dragon tongue, that dragon's mouth, where the world's just coming in and out today. It's stuck. It's from 1994. It comes down like the walls. Uh, earthquake, probably. That's pretty much what affects all the thermal features here, earthquake. Much the same, just in different ways. This is it from uh, a little bit further down the road. Really neat. <laughs> Too tired. Oh, yeah. Not canoe friendly. Uh. No. So we're still here at Gibbon Falls, and uh, one of the other kind of cool things is across the street is probably the most like dicey looking hillside against the road you've ever seen. It just like throw a pebble up there and get one moving and the whole thing comes down. Just amazing. Holy crap. It goes on for a ways too. Anyway, I saw that was pretty interesting. Like there's just certain seconds not to be somewhere and when that comes down, don't be on this road. <laughs> Close enough for you, baby. Oh, yeah. You should slow down. Big boy. There he is. Here we are at Undine uh, Falls. Quinn and Courtney have joined us now. Where's Cade? Cade's back there behind us. You can see the falls. Let's go down some more. You can see the falls. Undyne, Undyne Falls. <laughs> Quinn and Courtney's first foray into the park. Whee! Seen <laughs> elk and bears already. Yeah, saw mama and two baby bears. That was cool. This is all of us in Lamar Valley. Everybody's back except Dee. She's a photo hound. <laughs> Did you miss me? Yeah. <laughs> this is a pretty amazing mountain here, just solid rock. It's incredible. And the road goes through it. On the other side, it's just the same. It's an amazing thing. And one of the things that Cade spotted, which is really neat, is up at the top of that hill, you can see there's an eye right there. See the eye? That's cool. The mountain's watching. Tower Falls. The really neat falls with the towers. Make it look kind of weird, supernatural or something. Really neat.
what a video would be like without a selfie with McCade, McQueen, <laughs> and of course. <laughs> <laughs> Here we are at the Grand Teton Visitor Center, and I'm not sure what lake this is, but there's big enough boats in here that it looks really nice. Lake Tahoe. Yeah. And see, I always, I always hate it when Cade takes a picture and he never puts the people on. Oh yeah. Aren't you pretty this morning? Hmm? So I'm over here. Yeah. <laughs> right. <laughs> yeah. It's called video gra gravity, right? Yeah. Yeah. yeah, that's amazing, isn't it? See, and I, I love doing uh, this is when you do a selfie of a selfie, selfie, selfie. Wait, I'll have to start over. Selfie of a selfie. Yeah. <laughs> so pretty awesome and still growing. Sabrina, Cade, and Dee. It's a pretty picture. And then you have Quinn and Courtney. And hello. And this is the Jackson Park in the middle. It's where you have the antlers on all four sides. This is us on a biscuit basin. Oh, sapphire pool. It's almost fake. It's so cool. And it runs off white and then turns green. Really neat. Everybody's interested in each other. No one's looking at the sapphire pole. <laughs> Spence always comes to the ball seeing each other. We should just find a place to have, sit down and have coffee. <laughs> There's Dee, Sabrina, and Courtney, and the falls. Cade and Quinn on the upper trail. No, I'm alright, thanks, Court. It's amazing. See Quinn and Court here. It's a fairly decent long path down. And then D. Right. Hey. D and Kate. Come on, you can't hide. Yeah, Sabrina. Sabrina Kate. Do you like from the waterfall view? Nice. <clears throat> they need to cut that tree down right there. If I owned it, it'd be down now. Let me see it And then the feet are straight. You follow it all the way down. Steakhouse. Everything is looking very good. Look at that burger. Wow. <laughs> Courtney's having bison roast beef. Quinn's having a New York steak. 
and he's having that almond, or no, pecan trout. You're not pointing at the trout, Pat. Oh, sorry. <laughs> that, was, that was instinct, baby. Sorry, I couldn't avoid it. <laughs>